If you've ever decided to check on a product at Amazon while you're in a dark environment, then you've probably been blinded by the application still not having a proper dark theme on Android. And even when Google puts in the effort to add a feature that will force a dark theme on all of your applications, Amazon has gone out of their way to ignore the feature and actually block its app from being rendered with a dark theme. But there are a few ways we can force Amazon to be displayed on Android with a black theme. They do all come with some drawbacks though, so let's take a look at what our options are. The easiest and most common method of getting the Amazon application to render with a dark theme is to enable the color inversion feature within Android's settings application. So look for that accessibility menu and then begin to look for the color inversion option. Depending on which version of Android you have, some OEMs are tucking this behind the color and motion menu. So tap in there and you should find it right there. But you could also just search for the word inversion from the top of the settings app and you'll find it very quickly as well. Once color inversion has been enabled, go back to the Amazon application and it will invert every color that is displayed on the screen. So while this method is the fastest and it's even what the folks on iOS are forced to do, it does invert every color. So browsing for products with this feature on is gonna be a deal breaker for a lot of people. But you can see it does work and it is easy on the eyes in a dark environment. Earlier in the video, I mentioned that Android has a force dark theme feature that's built into the operating system. It's actually tucked away within the hidden developer options menu. So you will need to enable developer mode to find it. So if you're not familiar with what this feature is or where to find it, I'll have a link down below showing you how to enable developer mode so you can access developer options. From here, scroll down toward the bottom and you'll find an override force dark feature within the hardware accelerated rendering section. And this toggle works great to make a lot of unsupported applications finally be displayed with a dark theme. It doesn't always look the best, but in most cases, it's gonna be better than the alternative. The downside to this option though, is that Google actually lets developers opt out of the feature, which seems backwards if you ask me. But yes, Amazon was made aware of this and they have added this flag into their own application on Android. The good news here though, is that they've actually forgot to include this flag in a very specific version of the app. So if you don't mind using an outdated version of the Amazon app, then do this. We go in and we uninstall our current Amazon application. Then download version 28.9.2.100 of the Amazon application. And I'll even have a link to the APK Mirror website that I use down in the video description as well. That way it's easy for everyone to find. Once this has been downloaded, go ahead and open it up. And we're going to manually sideload this older version of the Amazon app. I also recommend you pull up the Google Play Store, search and find the Amazon Play Store page tap that three dot menu icon and then disable automatic updates. So we make sure that box is not checked. This way, your downgraded version of the Amazon app doesn't get updated with the rest of your applications. And you can see, once that toggle has been enabled, double check to make sure you have the override force dark toggle enabled within developer options and then launch that outdated version, we can open it up 
in the Amazon app is rendered with a dark theme. Now, the main downside here is that you're using an old version of the application. And I've read that this will actually prevent you from making a purchase within the app since it's using an old version of the APIs. But this will work for those who only need to browse products with the Amazon app. Even though Amazon does not have a dark theme built into its website, we can still use a trick within Chrome to do this work for us. The process is much easier than using an older version of the app since you can still make purchases as well. And this method works by first bringing up the Chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags page. From here, you're going to search for the word dark and that should filter out most of the other options, leaving you with a feature labeled auto dark mode for web contents. Go ahead and tap on that drop down, And then from here, we're gonna select the option labeled enabled with selective inversion of non image elements. This works similarly to the color inversion feature of Android, but only for websites. And setting it to this option will actually ignore all of the images since it's only inverting non-image elements. So after you change this, tap on the blue relaunch button in the bottom right corner so that the changes can take effect. And then we're gonna load up the Amazon website. You'll see that it's rendered in a nice dark theme with all of the features you'd expect to work in the website actually working and our images stay uninverted so we can actually browse and look at the products with ease. You can even tap on the three dot menu icon, select the add to home screen, and then add the Amazon website to your home screen as its own application. You can see it's been added right here. We have our application version on the right and then the website version on the left. So with this trick, it looks and functions incredibly similar to the application itself, but with a proper dark theme. Now, if today's guide was able to help fix your Amazon woes, then please consider giving it a like so that more people can be made aware of it. And please share it on your favorite social media websites too, as that really, really helps the channel to grow.